heard about walking on the moon, we're mapping it on NASA now. Did you know our first mapping of the moon began back in 1966 using photography? The moon does contain resources that could be invaluable as we learn to live and work in space. When we went to the moon back in the late 60s, early 70s, we went to six spots, worked hard for a couple days, mapped enough to know where to go, and we left it. We brought back samples, we did great stuff. There's a lot of the moon that's different left to explore. The moon is like a time capsule that preserves what was happening throughout the solar system, particularly around the Earth, a long time ago. Water ice recently discovered in dust at the bottom of a crater near the moon's south pole has mercury, magnesium, calcium, even a bit of silver in it. The discovery was made by the Lunar Crater Observation and Sensing Satellite called LCROSS. Hey, be sure to tell your teacher to visit NASA Explorer School's virtual campus.